The aviation sector is a major contributor to growing greenhouse gas emissions. It's producing around 2.4% of all emissions across the planet. Now that seems small, but that's forecast to rise quite significantly to between 25 and 50% by 2050. Zero Avia exists to help the world achieve net zero emission flight. Hydrogen electric aviation is what we're specialising in and so our goal is zero carbon. And we are creating a hydrogen electric powertrain that will retrofit into existing aircraft. The powertrain is everything that essentially supplies the power to the, the end, end use, which is in our case the propeller. We use hydrogen to convert into energy via fuel cells. So there's no combustion, that means no emissions. So the advantage over burning hydrogen, we don't get any nasty NOx particles, and over burning kerosene, we don't get any CO2 emissions. We are really passionate about inspiring and educating the next generation of students that are going to be flying around the world and are going to be, hopefully, working in a sustainable aviation sector. So our team of graduates have created a project. The main task the students will be doing is they'll have a model of the Boeing 737 and they'll be tasked to find a way to store hydrogen on this aircraft while minimising the drag impact. They'll be using some of the similar methodologies that we use here. They'll be using some of the equations, some of the calculations that are used across the board in aviation. It's a huge industry that's, um, that's growing by orders of magnitude like people wouldn't believe. In the UK and, and also kind of globally, there is a big demand for these skills and the supply does not meet the demand. There's so much work to be done and it's over the next 10 years. It's going to be a massive amount of work.